days when them say party We go hard, Campari, rum bar Every cup where we drink of it all Ease off when you see the young stars, stars, them now welcome back to another excuse for life now blessing goes out to all my viewers and all my subbies like share and also subscribe if you haven't done so already coming up in today's topic and review now you may have big toss up between the glp and the plp at the kingston and st andrew swearing of the mayor and the deputy mayor of kingston and from this clip you could hear the PNP supporter say the labor right them come for war Pope Jesus coming up now also this next topic Jamaica is at this all time I yes, have ever seen throughout my whole entire life in time it come to the mandem of Jamaica taking the life of women and children. St. Catherine, Jamaica, four people including a three-year-old child burned to D-E-A-T-H in their home in Central Village, St. Catherine on Tuesday morning after it was reported fire bomb. The mania a Coward of Jamaica, you know, and over what? Over politics. And now, I'm going to tell you why I say it's over politics. Did you know the family mayor? I know everybody around here. I know everybody around here. One of the victims, I have pictures in my phone that we took during the lead up to the elections. As a matter of fact, she said to me that she wanted me to give her a recommendation she wanted him to give her a recommendation so she could become a counselor of his division in spanish town and this is what unfolded Coming up in this one. Oh, no, watch this. The man at X that I represent for exclusive. Uh, What's up? Baby, let's go. Welcome to our website. We got loads of news and gossip for you today. But first, here's a new song. Ain't nobody wanna leave just yet. Where them feel this a legacy. See them come, but them is just a wanna be. See, pray. <laughs> feel we vibe just sweet. Anyway, we with it. But some job steam will be pleased. <sighs> Now, I don't know who is this little young artist, but this little young artist is a bad little youth. I go hard, but that artist is like, yeah, nobody bad up the street five with him, not nice. But no, say, yeah, I go on tight to do with him now. But here, yeah, we'll have a young star if you want to make some money. Fine rubber ranks, because him have the link for that little young youth. I don't know what his name, but I tell you, say, the youth bad. Fully locked in every day. Pull up in a machine for the lead. Week, another party again. Easy, we wall them streets, them a friend. You know, see the prey. Did he say, Buckle, but we tell them to put the bar on my feet. Easy, get down. Easy, take that. Easy, snatch that. Easy, alright. We are premium. <laughs> Oh, you hear me? I go on this my viewers and my subscribers. You can hear the lady with a video. The thing I said, the lady right them come for war. Now, as you know, the PNP is in a very celebrated mood because even though they lose the local government election, 
for some reason they are in a very celebrated mood especially because they have the mayor for Kingston and St. Andrew which they were swearing in the mayor just right there on the clip you see on the screen just now and as you can see because the GLP now as the deputy mayor and the PNP as the mayor of Kingston I don't know if I dot cast a riff but however as you can see all type of things broke out all type of things are gone <laughs> I am the Paris, you will be the Council, the It's definitely not a good look in 2024 for sister the people of Jamaica a kill up themselves over two man. It no look good. I need to check it out. So many of these politician names have been calling up in all kind of t business. People them for wise up. If you no say one party, you no say on a, on a party for the reason, but there's no point fighting and you know what I mean killing each other over two man. Where frankly, as I said, once them done with politics they are right you need to start focus on you and your family and stop all this violence amongst one another however you are can let me know your thoughts down in the comment section now my next topic this one breaks my heart because there's no point hiding the fact that this firebombing of these individual homes and these people losing their life just stem from out of nowhere. Now I want you to check out what the mayor of Spanish Town has to say about the deceased individual. Because as I said, it's clear that this has stem from politics. Check out what the mayor is saying right here. Did you know the family mayor? I know everybody around here. <laughs> I know everybody around here. One of the victims, I have pictures in my phone that we took during the lead up to the elections. As a matter of fact, she said to me that she wanted me to give her a recommendation. And I said to her, at this time, I'm a candidate. Wait until after the 26th, come back to me. And uh, as a matter of fact, I said, not only would I be your Council after the 26th, I would also continue as the mayor after the 26th, so you can come to the office of the mayor, because it will be me. Oh, you, how do you describe them as a peace-loving family? Um, you know, this young lady, well, one of the victims, um, Nikki, um, was just getting around to be so part of the working team that I have in the in the division and I I, I've, I found her as a, as a matter of fact the first meeting that she came to um, it was a, a cluster managers meeting and I inquired about her and she's was been around long, that she's been around long time now as a message from what me surmise some all of the articles that have been posted and when me put together, me can say, you know what I mean? It has something to do with politics. However, you are can let me know what you are think from what the mayor is saying. As me say, how likely it is for someone come take such suffices actions against you where them slaughter you and you listen a man. Yeah? And the only time we know them things they go on, you know, is in election time. So it seems like, say, we we'll have back the 80 election right here at our doorstep in 2024. Now, let me run through this article for sure. And it says, not only this young lady house has been firebombed, 
in the same central village. Now the article has said, St. Catherine, Jamaica, four persons including a three-year-old child burned to D-E-A-T-H in their home in central village St. Catherine on Tuesday morning after it was reportedly firebombed. Information reaching the Observer Online is that the house was set ablaze sometimes after 1 a.m. by unknown assailant. K-I-L-L-I-N-G, a mother, her two daughter, and her three-year-old grandson. Resident in the area reportedly heard scream coming from the house where the incident happened. The identity of the deceased have now been released. The people that may see now on the screen. This is the second suspected firebomb incident in Central Village in the last 24 hours. On Wednesday, a man was K-I-L-L-E-D and his home set ablaze. So you can see the same pattern. Now you can let me know your thoughts down in the comment section. Now the mayor for this constituency said something very interesting and I want you to listen keenly to what the man has said because if the government and the security minister doesn't take swift evasive action against these individuals it's gonna lead to other things. Check out what this man has to say. I'm calling on the, the government the Minister of National Security. I don't know who is you know, the new commissioner, but all the security apparatus of the country to leave no stones unturned to bring all these perpetrators to justice swiftly because one of the problems that we have and I don't come, uh, condone um, vigilante justice but vigilante justice is created when act like these are not dealt with expeditiously.